Ooh, so we got other side of winning semis. We're gonna have Lorenzo and Mooch playing. Bayonetta and Cole. Although, interested uh, good to see the Cole coming out from Mooch right now because the last few times I've seen him play, he's been going Bayonetta himself. So, I don't know what's kind of changed. But, I'm interested to see where this goes. And if game one goes poorly, I can probably predict what will happen game two. Policy has to take it down with me. Alright, so give me one second while I'm trying to have a headset for Oh, God. I don't know how to make it. The audio comes through both headphones. Oh, okay. So. I'm not muted? Okay, sweet. Alright, so go ahead and say something real quick. Go ahead, second. Hi, it's Paulus. Alright, I think this is pretty good, audio-wise. We got, you know, stock of peace now, Luenza and Mooch. Mooch. And I was kind of mentioning that Mooch has been playing Bayonetta himself the last few times we've seen him play. Uh, I didn't know that. He might actually have, uh, have learned a few things that might help him out in this matchup. Then. That's true. And I forgot, you actually haven't been too much lately. Not a, I haven't been able to come to a lot of Sonic, so I'm hoping to be able to come a lot more often now. Okay, cool. Oh, but he misses the ball. Bayonet is able, Lorenzo is able to shield. Ooh, and the counter, but Still not quite misses back. Oh, the witch time. It's like a really bad, ooh, but it misses. Yeah, he was just too high. Mooj is a second, second chance at victory here. Yeah. How much is he going to be able to make that bullet? Uh, I've seen him. I've seen him pull some crazy stuff off of that D move. So, oh yeah, Colin can definitely do some crazy stuff. I mean, it just takes. It just takes Ooh, one the good shot. The tipper is going to take it. Also, if you'll if you'll pay attention to the Discord for a second, everyone's. Everyone wants it. Wants what? They want it. But I don't. No balls, Mooch, do the ditto. Dude, really want this ditto is the... Uh, if, if they actually did this ditto, it would be horrible because everyone in this room would get cancer. <laughs> you said it, not me. Okay, so we're going to Lilat. Although with how with how well that first game went, I'm honestly not surprised that he's staying. Because that was looking really clean. Or at least he had a really strong finish to it. Well, that jab just does so much, but the frame one gets gets Bayonetta out of everything. That was him. Oh, oh no! Oh my god, the up tilt. Oh, oh no, uh, guys. Okay, the other I don't know if you just saw that, but he basically just did like 50% damage with nothing but up tilts. It almost looked like he was playing Fox. <laughs> All right. Next thing, next thing he's gonna try is to kill with an up air or something. Man, that move is so strong. The dragon thing. Yeah, the neutral special. I don't know what it's called. I think it's Dragon Fang. Dragon Fang? I'm pretty sure. Because it's one of the skills that Colin has in face. Got it. I think it's like Dragon Fang and Dragon Lunge is the side special. I don't know up or down. It almost breaks shields too. It's like, yeah, I saw that. It's good. But honestly, that doesn't mean a lot. Get up attack on those break shields. That's true. It, it makes me mad every time. It's like, why is my shield gone now? Ooh, and the... It's not going to be enough. The angle is just wrong. Can he get a tipper? 
Orenzo was really looking for that witch time, but it was pretty much wasted at this point. Just goes up the blitz, man. Yeah, I'm actually really upset that I can't think of what the up special is called. Uh, I would guess is. Dragon Wings. Or like Dragonfly or something. I don't know. I'm not gonna get it. Not gonna be enough still. That absence of rage is really hurting right now. Oh, but he gets it anyway, takes no damage. Lorenzo's uh, taking it the first stock, doesn't even attribute to anything at this point. Oh, it looks like a really even game. Lorenzo getting that grab, though. Returned with a jab. Back to even percent. But now he's caught. Forgot he already used the jump. Man, Bayonetta. So many jumps, I just think she has infinite. She's got like one jump that she could use a hundred times. Not really. So that's how it feels about down throw, uh, Bayonetta just jumping out of it, doesn't want any of that. Oh wow, look at Mooch convert to the, uh, the Dragon thing. I'm gonna try and sound smart like I know what I'm talking about now. That's why I say like Illusion and Phantasm and everything. I don't know, for some reason addressing specials by the official name. Oh, but he misses the grab. He tried to grab but he wasn't close enough and it kind of put him in a bad spot, all things considered. Yeah, you're not lying. Oh, you know, you know what's a fun name? So you know, you know it's the afterburner kick, right? Yeah. Uh, if you do it down, it's the dab kick. The dab kick. Downward afterburner kick. I love it. It is so bad, but I love it so much. Not gonna be enough. I, for some reason, I was thinking Corrin's grabs are a little better than what I'm seeing here. Yeah, that those. Couple more of those though. Uh, both characters basically a kill percent. Is that going to take it? No, the DI is going to save him. This game is coming down to the wire. We've seen Bayonetta make these comebacks before. Lorenzo is anything but out of this. Ooh, but he goes for the F-Smash. Man, it was almost over right there. Oh, but this, this is looking so tense. I it's gonna be speak. enough! Ooh. And Mooj is gonna take it from Lorenzo. Ooh. Yeah, that was a really good set. Really good stuff to Mooj. I had doubts when I saw the pull in, but he he really showed up.